Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Hayes Crew Outside. I'm Hayes Crew. Glad to see you. Hope all is well. Please like and subscribe. Today we're out at West Neck Creek, or some people call it West Neck Drainage Ditch. We're going for bass and catfish. Let's do some fishing. So as you can see, this is really tight. There's a lot of structure on the edges. You can actually go underneath the edge by about a foot where the water's cut it out. It's high tide right now. And uh, this is only between two to five foot of water tops. What I like about that is it tightens up where the fish can go. Narrows down there. All right, there's some structure right there. Bait's still on. I'm seeing some fish jump. And I've seen bass in here, carp, uh, freshwater gar. Definitely caught a lot of catfish here before, which is why I'm back. But absolutely beautiful day. And it protects me from the wind. I can't stand wind on a kayak. And right now it's okay, but they're calling for heavy winds a little bit later. We're using a 30 pound monofilament on basically pool, noodle, pool noodles with PVC pipe through it. Okay, some of the baits on the bottom, some of the baits about midway, using different amounts of weights. When I don't want the bait to move, I'll use a 20 ounce sinker. Uh, sometimes I, I do want the weight, uh, the, the noodle to move a little bit, so I'll use lighter weight. And I'm keeping the line tight, so as I get a better hookup and this um, noodle, when it's tight, boom, will stand straight up so I know it has a fish. If the line's too loose, you may never know you have a fish on it. Gives it time to work its way out, Give, gives it time to get snagged, which I'm not looking forward to. Um, who is? But in either case, we're gonna check this off and on. I'm gonna fish for some bass too, because I know there's some bass out here using a, um, Top water. Whopper plopper. Really like the water displacement on those. I also use uh, torpedoes, but today it's just going to be a, a mini whopper plopper. I'm using nothing but circle hooks. Um, big fan of the Gamagatsus. They're, you know, for me, one of the best hooks out there. Of course, I'm always looking for snakes in these trees. Oh, nothing. But now we wait. Everything's been deployed. Uh, tide should be going out soon. And I'm gonna do some bass fishing. I'm using braid uh, on this pole today, and I should have put a mono leader on it, probably two foot is what I usually use. The, what happens is with the braid, it, it curls up easier and wraps itself around the lure. So it, as you can see, I've got to untangle it several times if I don't have that, that mono leader on it.
Little dab. Looks like we got a bite. Yeah, we do. And that is on Catfish Pro Blood. Oh yeah. See what that circle hook is? Right there, that's what it's supposed to be doing. Not bad looking. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. See you next time. Please put outside.